Hi everyone, this is Asma Khali from CyberPanel and in today's video we will be talking about reverse DNS, how you can set it up and how you can look it up. So uh, reverse DNS basically is a type of name a resolution that looks up IP addresses to get the domain name instead of DNS which actually converts your domain name into IP addresses. So in this video we will be uh, checking out how you can look up DNS in uh, Windows in a Linux machine and using online tools and we'll able, we will be seeing how you can set up your reverse DNS uh, with uh, server providers. I'll be using Vulture and Hetzna today and after that we'll see how you can issue SSL against that domain name. So without further ado let's just jump straight to the video. Okay, so first of all, we are going to see how you can look up your reverse DNS in uh, Windows, in Linux, and using an online tool. So for Windows, simply in run, enter the CMD, and with over here, enter NS, look up, and after that, you have to enter your IP. Once you do that, click enter and it's going to give you the name of your reverse, DN, uh, reverse DNS. So for this IP address, we have dns.google. Now this is how you can check it out uh, on Windows. Now we're going to see how you can see that using a Linux machine. Okay, so over here, we can uh, do two commands. We can do the dig command and we can do the host command. So for the dig command you simply have to write dig minus x that is the type and after that simply enter your ip and once you do that click enter oh i forgot the full one dig minus x 8.8.8.8 click enter and now it's going to give you your uh, dns uh, your reverse dns it's right over here. Now this is how you can check out your uh, reverse DNS using the dig command. Now uh, uh, with the host command, you simply have to write host and after that enter your IP. So over here you can see that domain name pointer and here is your reverse DNS. It's super simple to get your reverse DNS using either Windows or a Linux machine. So now let us see how you can check out your reverse DNS using an online tool. I'm using MX Toolbox. Over here you simply again have to write your IP address and click on reverse lookup and as simple as that it's going to give you your reverse DNS right over here. So this is how you can see your reverse DNS using a Windows uh, using uh, in Windows in a Linux machine and using an online tool. Okay, so now we have seen how we can look up your reverse DNS. Now let us see how you can set your reverse DNS with your server providers. Now with DNS, you set it up with from wherever you have bought your domain. But with reverse DNS, you set it up with your server provider. So I'm you. Every server provider has their own uh, method, but I'm using Vulture and Headstand uh, today, and I'll show you how simple it is to set up your reverse DNS. So enter your Vulture account, log into it, and scroll down, open up any one of your VPS. I'm just gonna go with the very first one. From here, click on settings. Once you do that, you'll see that this is your address, your net mask, your gateway, your reverse DNS. Now I've already set my reverse DNS, but I'll show you how you can edit it. For example, if instead of your domain name, you're seeing your pointer, so simply click on it, change your reverse DNS, and click on this tick mark. Once you do that, it's saved. Now this is how you can set up on Vulture. Now we'll see how you can set it up on Hexner. Open up your Hexner, open your project. From here, open any one of your VPS. Once you enter it, click on networking from the left-hand side menu. And again, I have set up a reverse DNS over here, but if you don't see your reverse DNS or you see a pointer over here, simply click on the options. Click on edit reverse DNS and you can edit your reverse DNS over here. Once you're happy with it, click on edit reverse DNS and that's it. Now let's look up, look this up with MX tool. 
and you will see that my reverse DNS, my domain name is here. Same with the virtual one, I'll copy this quickly. Oh, I just copied the whole line. And you'll see our domain name is right over here. So you guys can see how simple it is to set up your reverse DNS with your server providers. Of course, every server provider is going to have their own methods. So you can check that out, but essentially it's very simple to do so. All right, so now we're gonna see how we can issue mail server SSL against the domain for which you want to create our DNS for in Cyber Panel. So it's super simple, just log into your Cyber Panel. From here, scroll down. You will see SSL from the left-hand side menu, click on it and enter main server SSL. Once you do that, select your site. So I have already previously created a setup using cyberpanel.net, so I'll click on that and click on issue SSL. Now it's again, it's super simple to do that and you have to be careful that uh, your domain name is the same as that of the RDNS that you're setting up uh, with the server providers. Okay, so my SSL is issued, uh, your mail server now uses, uh, now let's encrypt. Okay, so now the mail server host name will be that of the domain name. So for example, if you send any mail, uh, it, the address on top of it will show cyberpanel.net. So that's it for today. That's it for today's video. If you still have any questions, just drop a comment in the comment section and don't forget to like and subscribe Cyberpanel.